Good morning. Um, as you can see, I still have my do-rag on. It's a very IDGAF type of day. Um, the last two days didn't really go how I wanted to, so I'm just going to do what I want today. Um, I'm not going to worry about any prompts. I'm just going to make music today. I'm not going to worry about a time limit. I need to just let it flow today. Let's go ahead and make sure that we remember to hit the screen today. Let's do that. All right. And here we go. I think I want to use one of the drum loops I made the other day. Let's just go through and see what we have and what we have made recently. Yeah, that's what that's what that eventually turned into. I kind of feel like I want to go back and work on that beat some more. So that's what I'm going to do, you know? I feel like I should have like a breakdown and then bring it back and have it all dramatic. Like, how do I want to do that? What am I hearing? I definitely need to put like a riser or something, transition effects. I want to make a dramatic and dynamic so that it really hits when that part comes in. And I'm not sure how I'm going to do that yet, but I know that's what I want to do. I might just end up having to create my own. You know what? I don't understand and I don't feel like trying to like deal with that right now. And I know I want to do some processing on this, um, that transition too, because it's just very basic, but I just kind of wanted to get the, the filter change down. So let's test run. Cl closer, we're getting closer. I think I want to mute everything just for a split second before it all comes back in. I feel like some type of plucked instrument, maybe. So I just wanted to say this, not feeling these sounds. And typically when I like try to push myself to expand a beat, I run into this thing where it's just like, I kind of have a basis of an idea of what I want to do. I just don't have the exact sounds and stuff yet. And then I end up just putting sounds that I just don't like. And it just makes me like cringe. I do not like this, but you know, we can recover. I just want to say that. All right, back to the regularly scheduled program. I feel like I've been making the most minimal changes to this beat, like... I think I've been just listening through, I'm gonna start on another one. Yeah. 
I think I can make something dramatic here happen too with the drums. I just feel like nothing I do is going to drastically change how I feel about this beat. Like I like the sample. It's a nice ride, but I'm not really sure. We're going to come back to this. I think I'm over this for the moment. On to the next. Do I just want to start a new project? Yeah, let's start a new project. Let's do that. All right. I think I'm back now and in a little bit of a better mood, um, slightly more energized and ready to try this again. My inability to keep things simple when it comes to R&B just like astounds me. Every time I listen to it, I'm just like, oh my God, I can make that. And then when I try to, it's like, mm, mm, mm. so um, we're going to try it again and we're going to stick to the basics. This is still like, this is too simple. This is not like the groove I wanted. I, I think that's what the problem I keep coming into. I try to make a simple R&B like drum loop and groove and it kind of just falls into the same groove. So I'm, I'm gonna figure out a way to like switch that up. But like, I gotta learn how to keep it simple and interesting. And I guess that's today's challenge. So, all right, let's continue. Not crazy about it. Thought I was going somewhere, then I lost it. And I'm gonna just use a different drum loop. I am so bored. I need it to be a little bit more creative. Let's let's turn the tempo up. Not crazy about it. I'm gonna stop here for now. I feel so defeated today. This whole week I've been trying to accomplish a particular goal and it just seems like it's just not happening for me this week so far, but there's still two more days left. So hopefully, you know, peace and love child, I'm over it. <laughs>